Hey guys, welcome back to some more FTL. Today, uh, we are going to be doing the rock ship by popular demand in the comments. Uh, so I basically just, uh, whoever just, up, whatever's upvoted the most, I just do it. So there's a Type A and a Type B, and obviously like every other ship. The Type A is more of like the missile kind of weapon, like kind of like the ships that you would see if you actually entered rock space. Um, so they're very... You obviously have huge ammo limitations, so it's usually a good idea to either go for like a boarding runner or something like that, which is kind of cool. Uh, but we're doing the more interesting than two, which is uh, this one. No doors, uh, as in no door systems. And they're, the doors don't even lead outside, which means if there's a fire, you have to put it out with the rock band. It's it's a major problem with the fire or the fire stuff. But you get the fire bomb, which means you can light fires on, on the other ship. Also, heavy pierce missile, uh, uh, heavy pierce laser, which uh, goes through one uh, shield. So it's good for the first two systems, maybe, and then you can just kind of throw that shit right out. So uh, we are going to name this the USS Rock Hard. Obviously, a Navy ship. Had to get my dick joke in. Okay. <laughs> uh, so obviously, I'm going to be on the ship. Uh, Graffin. Sure. Well. Well, we'll rename everyone. So the person who requested it uh, was Hyperion. So Hyperion XV. So you get to be a part of the ship. Uh, someone else who commented and made the same request, Xstar K, uh, Regdar K. It's like Crast is his last name or whatever for his thing. And the last person, um, I don't know who the hell I'm gonna make this. Let's make it a uh, Canned. Fuck you, can't. Everyone else gets uh, capitalized. So you also get the rock plating augmentation, which basically is the exact opposite of what the stealth uh, cruiser's titanium plating did. Which this one, they'll still do damage to systems if they hit them, but I have a 15% chance to negate all the damage. So it's kind of nice. Uh, so this is a kind of cool ship. I, I really like this one. So let's go. Let's go start it up. Um, so let's go put everyone onto systems. And so I'll introduce uh, some other elements of the ship. Uh, we have two bars of O2. Uh, this is automatically upgraded O2, which is kind of nice. You can fill oxygen in really quick if you need to. And also, it, if it gets hit, it's not a big deal. Um, we also only get three bars in the weapons, which means it can get hit once and my weapon will still remain up. Kind of useful, kind of nice, not gonna lie. Uh, However, I can't power both the firebomb and the heavy pierce at the same time, unless I upgrade it, uh, which I will not be doing. Uh, and I'll, you'll see why. <laughs> so let's let's get started and start uh, heading up towards that nebula. Uh, so this guy wants to be uh, escorted, so I will accept that. Okay, one f one fuels, one fuel. You might as well. It might be a trap. Who knows? It's uh, he's gonna be fucked. So there's a smuggler nearby trying to stay away from the beacon. So let's go attack him power up my weapons. Holy shit, he's got a lot of lasers. That's not good. Well, uh, regardless, uh, we're going to... <sighs> yeah, I missed mine. Oh, my shields went down. How fantastic. So, the thing about the rock people is they're very good at combat. They have 150 HP, so they're... <sighs> Jesus, like, I, I don't even know at this point what to even say. I missed twice. Twice. And they even hit the, my O2's on fire right now. That, this fantastic being. You know, I, I, at this point, you can't even criticize, like, I should have done something differently. I fucking missed. Uh, actually, no, keep charging that. Oh, I need to keep that down. So basically, I have to pull people off all the time. No, I'm gonna kill you because I'm, you're, I'm an asshole like that. Oh boy. They have so many freaking weapons, and probably like an NG repairing that. Luckily, I did. You can hear the hull breach sound effect, so we're all good. Uh, that kind of annoyed me. <laughs> okay, so that's it. We seem to survive. We're good. Okay, and we can use the O2. Look how look how fast this fucking O2 goes back up. Holy shit! Like it's just that's ridiculous. All right, get this guy healed up, and we're good to go. So, uh, if you notice, I keep a, I have a point in the med bay. I don't have anything else to really put that into. What, like oxygen? Yeah, just in case. Like, it's uh, no point. 
you know it's you we have we have actually an overabundance of energy it's kind of strange uh, despite the harsh conditions, uh, you know, the minute I say abundance of energy, we go into a fucking plasma storm. Oh, look at this! Look at this professional. He's got a he's got a defense drone here, and so like, there's no point in me powering that because I might as well have high evade. But it doesn't matter; I'll get hit anyways. Rest. Don't worry, guys. If, in case you're wondering why, if I if I'm gonna be unlucky. Usually I just kind of like power random crap, like I just kind of like now nah, I'm like attacking that instead, you know. I, I kind of just change change my focus every once in a while. No, I will not accept your damn surrender. Nope, attack that. Keep his weapons down, you know. That that's the strategy. That, you know, it's it's been kind of a running theme. Uh, if you've noticed, is like I always keep my weapons fully charged. Uh, so you know, it's it's just kind of that thing I do, and we're done. Actually, well, just keep engines powered. Thanks for your substantial use of whatever. Uh, look how fast my oxygen goes back up. I love that. It's ca it's kind of fun. It, it kind of is. I like the fact that the, the oxygen goes back up so fast. I, I don't really have to worry about it. It's just not one of those things that you really concern yourself with. I want to go to that store, but if I go down there, I I I, I want more scrap though. Yeah, it's not worth it going to the store quite as of yet. I'm saving for a crew teleporter because I'm actually going to bring myself to be a, a, a teleporting ship. Uh, so before I contact him, they fade. Okay, I'm going to attempt to follow them and help him. Oh, cool. It's another rock guy. <laughs> Just what I needed. Alright, you can stay right there then. While I continue on my merry way. Oh, probably I should also power up my things. This is great. Like, I, I run to his son thing. Like, I really unlucky starting of this run. Alright, well, he's he's gonna go and engage me, so I'm gonna go power up my weapons. At least I have someone to kind of, like, put out fires for me, you know. It's kind of useful. But yeah, so there's a drone now attacking me and his son. Uh, in case you don't remember what the suns do, they create fires on your ship. That is something I can't vent. I don't know if you've been noticing the theme so far of the ship, but uh, it's basically me just getting fucked up. So this guy will handle it. Okay. Luckily this will make everything come on faster, charge up faster. I get some scrap materials, let's just wait for that to charge up. This guy will handle all that, because I have nothing else to put him on. Yeah, let's just do the quest, we might as well. The escort ship uh, is at the request of Beacon. Much of your we walked right into a trap. Okay. There's a, a drone here, so we will take out that because the shields are actually enough to prevent him from attacking me. In whoops. Uh oh no, no, stay on there. Sorry, Drake boxing. Good. It missed. So now we're good. So this guy's at least getting like a lot of experience with the shields as well. We might as well hit the drone bay. Like I, I just keep I, I just keep switching targets. That's kind of how I go. So basically, I'm kind of all I'm doing is I'm kind of biding my time for that uh, for that teleporter. I deem that as the most important thing for me to get right, right now at the moment uh, because that that completely changes the way I play this this class. And this is not necessarily a good boarding ship, but it's a fun one because you get to do a fire fire bomb before you even board kind of thing. It's it's interesting. All right. Well, we take some scrap material, and, uh, that's it. Like, did we not, like, tr like try and, like, give that guy stern talking to for leading us into a trap? Okay, uh, we will never surrender our crew to one of the tr the slavers. Alright. You boarded us? Seriously? Do you even board? Like, seriously. There we go. Took out both of his weapons, now we attack his cockpit. Because then you won't be able to evade shots, and they're they're just scrambling around trying to like. Okay, well, now he's back on, over there. That's fine. There's just there's no point in taking out shields because the shields are just not uh, really that important of a factor. Because I, I pierce through them right now. Like I, actually, like this is the kind of ship actually I would. Uh, the only ships, the only shields I'm really worried about is the uh, Zoltan shields. That's it. Like that's there's no other point. 
actually no, attack that. I'm gonna try and escape, seriously. Of all, of all the nerve, like, could you not offer me like a crew member? Also, I have too many crew members. RNG. Oh, you're kidding me. You're kidding me. <laughs> I cry myself to sleep. All right. Well then. <laughs> the view is very beautiful, apparently. The view of ships jumping into FTL. This is like a really, it's honestly, it's a weak weapon. It's enough to get past this sector, but you know, I'm gonna fight the mercenary, cause fuck him. Oh no, not the beam, beam drone. It's my worst enemy. You got a beam, beam drone and, and that thing. Okay. You got it. sorry, a missile weapon and a beam drone. Like, nothing to take out shields. Like, I, I, I don't even know sometimes. This is the best ship ever! It's, he's a bit of, he's a tactical genius. I know a lot of people have, like, a little bit, like, low health. Low is subjective, it's, it's slightly down health, but they have so much health, I, I, I don't even care. That's gonna make all the difference. Uh, you can't even jump into FDL. I'm, I'm like taking down all the systems. And this is how you boarding ship. Okay, we're good. 17 scrap. Alright. I'm just exploring all these outer systems. I figure I might as well. Uh, I have no need for, for drone parts, so I will reject their offer. And let's head on into this system here. <laughs> this jump leads me to nothing to empty space. Okay. Thanks, game. Okay, there's no point in going up there because I don't have to go fight the, uh, the, the, the rebel ships, so no. So, uh, FTL is ready and I discover a usable drone. Hell yeah. Okay, let's go put another point into engines so I don't have to have this medbay powered the entire time and we're good. Because I was kind of just saving up for a store, but you know, I'll go to engine controlled space. All right, Mantis has been uh, threatening NG Core worlds, but you were, will be able to stock up for my journey. Need to find a store, because I need to change the pace of my game so much. Okay, so we got actually a rock plating uh, thing. So basically there's um, a ship without life forms is nearby, uh, and it's giving off a distress call. Uh, so I can either search for it, or I can search through the ship without fear of stray uh, asteroids, because rock, rock plating. Uh, I find I find a ship coated with ice and crystal. Uh, everything is nearly destroyed, but there's a stasis pod. This is basically how you'd get to the crystal people, the, the crystal ship. So there's no point. I, since I already have, I'm not going to grab the stasis chamber. I'm going to take the weapon I find. And there's a burst laser Mark II and a scrap of 13. And this is kind of nice because now I have actually a better option to bring my bring my way through uh, peer, through um, shields. So uh, the Zoltan shields that is. It's better than the the the, the heavy pierce. Um, there's a there's a defense satellite, but uh, the recruit the, the repair crew that's trying to fix it can't go there without being fired upon. So I can destroy it from a distance. I can try to at least. It took a bit of damage, unfortunately, so it didn't really work. And there's a store right here. Um, not exactly the kind of place I want to be because it's like really close to there, but. Uh, close to the exit, but I because I, I still want to explore. I'm not, it's not a race to the end, you know. It's all about the it's about the mission, not the whatever. Uh, okay, uh, nothing I really want here. I, I, you see, I, if I got a hull smasher laser, I could I could do some sort of run where I'm trying to be a. I might as well get a an NG. I will do that. The reason I got an NG is because the rocks are not too good at running around and repairing people. Okay, I can go over there and this guy will get on weapons. Alright. Weapons I don't deem to be as important as you would think. And there's a mercenary ship wanting me to aid him. Okay, I'll accept. Uh, my usual carrier is a bit slow. I need you to d d deliver uh, uh, some drone parts. And so he added a quest marker to my map. Uh, oh, there's a store there. We will go there last. Because I have lots of time before the rebel fleet comes in. And, and also I have no money anymore. Uh, there's Federation markings. There's a ship right here. So let's go and kick his ass. And unfortunately, he has a lot of weapons on him. Makes me kind of sad on the inside. Alright. 
I'll let all the rock people come and help out with this, uh, this shield problem we have. No, we took damage from that. You will pay dearly for your error. No point in me bringing up the NG, this is like just as good as an NG. I mean, it's, it's three rock guys. Oh, power it. Why would I not want to power it? Like, seriously. In what universe do you live in that I would not want to power my weapons? So, it's a, it's a, it's a trade-off between whatever's uh, like cockpit and weapons. Cockpit helps me make more sec like sequential hits. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I think that's the right word for that. And then that, that last hit doesn't even matter, so I'll just hit wherever. It's always my strategy of uh, taking out weapons. So, there's a rebel ship, but they're poorly equipped. I don't have anything to give them, so... I don't know. Sue me. Okay, so I'm thinking we go... I don't know if I'm gonna have enough time, so I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go, just go up the... I'm gonna go down the right side. And distress call was a trap, luring unsuspecting ships like myself to here. But he doesn't—he's not really outfitted very well, so I, I'm not too concerned at this point. Because I could just—I took out his weapons pretty much immediately. I'm sad I do not have a teleport. That's—that's—that's that's, that's the whole point of me being here. Is to have a teleport. It's the best way of playing the ship, and it's just as I said, it's the luck of the draw have to hope that the game will be the RNG gods will be favorable to you and get you a store with the uh, uh, more concerned with taking this out because when he powers both then he can actually hurt me good strategy you gotta be kidding me okay I'm just I might as well just finish him off like this it's a bit of a waiting game not gonna lie because it's just, it, you literally have one offensive weapon. I could get another point and do these burst lasers, but... As I said, I'm, I'm trying to go, like, boarding rock ship, because that's way more fun. Alright, so we got a substantial amount of useful material. Alright, well, let's keep uh, heading down the side here. I will aid the civilian ship. And it's a Mantis ship, and they will power their weapons. But they will fail. And we already have ships with med bays, which is not good for me, because uh, I was hoping to do more boarding action. Go my repair rock crew. Show them how it's done. Well, holy crap, what? How'd that... D does, it, does this get... Oh, it can, it can cause fires. Interesting. I didn't actually know it would do that. Or either it's a Mantis ship, they probably just were trying to heal it, and they're like... They fucked up or something? <laughs> I don't know. Because that only happens when you cause a fire. Like, is that kind of damage. Okay, we all attempt to... A uh, civilian ship ran away. Oh. I'm, sort, I'm just sort of sad. The civilian ship doesn't want me. Alright. Uh, I'm supposed to deliver the drone parts. Uh, a small research station. There's no response to it. You know, the last time I did this, I lost a crew member. Let's fucking do it anyways. Ah, uh, wonder, wondrous. Oh. Oh, cool! I got someone out of this. Okay, well... They fucked with the wrong ship, motherfucker. Yeah, board, board my med bay. That's the best idea I've ever seen. Uh, what should this guy be on? Probably engines. Yeah, you go, you go do, man the engines. I mean, Hyperion wasn't getting that good of them. He, he's just a rock. Rocks can't drive. I'm not being I'm not being sexist against rocks. I, just, I swear. Okay, now I have an overabundance of crew. Actually, who was the guy I had on weapons before? I think it was Canned. All right. I I didn't actually expect to be getting this much crew right now. Um, so you know, I'm trying to get everyone to specialize in their thing. So, whatevs. Alright, well, what do we have up next here? Oh, it's an energy ship. Are you fucking kidding me? I, I can't seem to catch a break with, like... Well, actually, no, I, I want to I wanna kill this stuff. But, you know, I, every time I go to one of these ships, I'm like, I kind of want to board it. And we don't board it. Oh, well, uh, we both missed. Are you kidding me? That's my only offensive option. This 
guy's like the worst. As I said, I could, I could try and fire beam him or some shit, but as fire bomb him or some shit, but it's just, it just ain't worth it. It's I, I don't really see the point. There we go. I got one good hit in. They probably have a repair drone or something. There we go. Now we're actually hitting shit. Take out his systems one by one. That's what's important. So he probably has repair drones and anti-personnel drones and shit, so I'm gonna take out his drone thing, because it's repairing things rather quickly. No, we will not accept surrender, even though I kind of want the fuel. Fuel's nice, but you know, don't need it. And he's dead. It's the end of that one. Ton of useful material, okay. Fortunately, he's going to be in radius of me when I reach the beacon, but, uh, fucking no teleport. <laughs> Gotta be kidding me. This game. I, I want to do great runs to show you, but, you know, fuck, there's no point in this. Well, uh, time to show off how the firebomb works. So basically, herp to derp, uh, derp derp derp. Probably should put another point to engines, because I have a free Zoltan point. This is gonna hurt. Oh, I resisted it. Nice. What? Is that actually working? Sure, let's let's do fire. I I, I wish I could see what was on his ship. Actually, maybe it's... Yeah, you know, it's not worth it. What is it? I get, like, one fuel out of it? I shouldn't have done that. Alright, well, to NG Homeworlds, because we love NGs and not Zoltan Shields. Alright, um, so they're usually willing to help. Uh, so since... Oh, well, there is a store nearby, so... Uh, well, uh, fine, I'll take a look. I'll see if there's a teleporter. Fine, you guys win. Uh, okay. Your teleporter, there we go. Okay. We will sell 27... Let me just do some math in my head. Six. No, I wouldn't have enough. Oh, I can sell this. Oh, cool. Okay, never mind. Uh, I'm almost inclined to actually sell the heavy pierce. Actually, I will. We don't need that anymore. All right. Um, so now we have a teleporter. The teleporters are kind of cool. And now that I don't have to get that extra point, now I can just go get some fuel. And that's it. Door systems, not useful, because when you think about it, uh, I can't open these doors, you're absolutely correct, but why would I want to? Um, there's no venting. Uh, the, the best I could do is like prevent intruders from coming and prevent fire from spreading. Well, fires I can deal with pretty effectively if I'm smart about it. It's like, it's like, and it's like 80 scrap to get the first benefit because I don't think normal doors, like the normal doors are better than no doors. Because all it does is let me control it for venting atmosphere and I can't vent atmosphere on the ship, so I'm not going to get it. Anyways, okay, uh, I'm gonna go heal these guys up and uh, we'll uh, continue this uh, tomorrow, so I'll see you next time. Bye.